Uh, good morning, a good evening, or a good afternoon, and thank you for joining us once again, the Models of Gaming. I am Kaiju K. With me here is Juggernaut Jared. Hello. There's also a model bear living nearby. No. And we are going to one of the most unusually designed maps I've ever had the experience with. This is the Baltimore Waterfront. Juggernaut has never seen this before, but he's going to have some fun with this one. Ready, Jug? Ooh. Yes, I am. All right. So welcome, if you will, to the Baltimore Waterfront. Now, if you might notice, you might notice that there is no bank here. Yeah. That is 100% true. However, there are things like little stores here. Where you can, like, I guess you could go in here and hack the ATM machine. Um, lots of little money you can pick up around here. It's, uh... It's very strange. Uh, there's donuts, by the way. There's donuts you can eat. Um, there's a hackable for the crypto. This map is almost begging you to have a crypto uh, to make it work. Um, another location here. Some more little money here. I, I actually like I found this. a vault. Oh, hang on a second. Where are you at? Oh, you actually uh, went in. You I'm going to be going back down. You shouldn't have gone in yet. Okay, well, there is a little bank over here. Um, I was going to show off the waterfront first. Uh, but we'll, we'll continue that in a second. Okay. So if you look at over here, you have the ATM machines. Uh, a coffee machine, but unfortunately we can do nothing with it, sadly. Um, the classic, if I might say. Sneaky, sneaky. Excuse me, good sir. 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 Hello, sir. He's in my way. This leads somewhere else, as you plainly see. Oh, hang on a second. <laughs> no, I don't want to be. Ah, dang it. <laughs> All right, so I'm, I'm going to back out of here for a second because apparently it doesn't like me in there. Um, we'll continue looking around the bank real quick. So that's cautioned off for the moment. Some donuts and more hidden secret files here. More hidden locations here for no reason. Hackables for the crypto. And I see a vault, but I don't want there to be a vault there. Can you fix that, Juggernaut? Ah, thank you, Juggernaut. Nice. So if you go in here, you'll find a shop. There's actually not that much money in here. There's some bars, though. There's probably enough to weasel up a few bucks. And this is the elevator. We'll be going on that in a second. A emergency escape, if you will. You can just open that one right up. And this would be the area that we were just sneaking through. And this leads up to the second floor. Welcome to the second floor, or as I like to call it, Crypto Heaven. Lots of things you can hack with the crypto. Lots of locations you can sneak in, including the safe space above the safe space. Ha 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 ha. And turn out some people. Another room with another hackable in it. The crypto could really just go to town on this map. Really good. Um, yeah. Oh, jeez. He was in the way. Did you all see what else was in here, my friend? Mm-hmm. So in this room is some gold and some money you can pick up. No witnesses. We can run around here real quick. I know we could blow a hole in the windows, but I just wanted to show it off. Once again, welcome to Crypto World. And there's still a elevator. I bet you if I push this button, I go down. My juggernaut, I pushed the button. Can you guess which direction I went in? You went down. That is correct, my good sir. Now, the funny thing is that this bank is unusual because it's nowhere near where the usual banks are. It's kind of off to the side. 
and there's a hot pizza sign here. So another quick location I can show off real quick is there is a pizza parlor over here. Which once again you can hack and you can run through. Uh, they should get the different uniforms for these guys if you're wearing the white. But back here is an interesting thing. Oh no, what is this? This looks like it could possibly be. No, it couldn't possibly be a safe, could it? Why, it was a tiny safe. But there is an awful lot of money in such a tiny safe. That's 21000 right there. Man, what kind of pizza is place making to have that kind of money? Serious. Uh, the bomb bag is right here in case you need it. Um, keep running over here. There's, I believe, the juice part. No, this is the clothing stuff. Which does have some nice jewelry in the back if you want to grab it. It's not as much as the Mafia also usually has, but it's pretty cool. And, of course, this is where one of the bank trucks are back here. Ahem, sorry, vans. The ambulance is right in the center stage. Speaking of center stage, this one actually has a stage stage. And these can be hackable. There's a few things here and there inside this place, but there's plenty of places where you can hack. Get some free money. And of course there's the, uh, the bongo bag here. Point. I'm on top of it. Thank you. The police start right around here, which gives them a rather large... Now, I know I'm missing one of the buildings. I'm missing one of the entrance ways. Um, drop, your drop your money off, my buddy. Um, so, yeah, so the police start off over here. As you can see, there's building materials and everything around it. Did I miss it over here? Was this it? Ah, this might be it here over here. Is it? Okay. I like the balloon. The balloon is nice. I like the balloon as well. Um, what I really liked about this map when I first saw it was the fact that there is a literal ton of just fun locations here. You can actually walk by the bank, which I did, and still enjoy everything. I mean, this, this is a very, very nice... This is one of the most impressive maps I've ever played on. Or been on, rather. I have not played on it yet. We might play on it in a future episode of the Modern Social Gaming. If you'd like to see that, please mention it down below. Um, so, if you were to come in naturally, this is where the bank parking lot would be. As you can see, that would lead to the bazaar, which would be bizarre of you to think. <laughs> uh, the dad jokes never end. I apologize. The only thing that upsets me more is they have the prime opportunity to put a clothing bag in here that you could change. Now I have to kill somebody to change. But anyway, apparently Juggernaut's been murdering people left, right, and center. Um... There's the back end up there. Bless you. And uh, there's one more thing I want to show before we're done. I don't think I get the idea of this character though, but... Yeah, so anyways... Let's see if I'm going to try it one more time here. Right there... You can't see it very well, but ah, it's, it's just a, it's a floating bag. Okay, I, I don't know if you can actually get it. I mean, I'm sure with the drone you could probably get it. Yeah, I mean, most maps are banks, factories. Even I've even seen a uh, a boat, but this right here, this is just I like this map. I do. I like this map. I would suggest you play on it. Um, it's a harder map. This is this is a, but it is a fun map. Yes, it is a fun map. It is a harder map, but it is a fun map. And depending on what class you are, um, you could just rob this place blind, or just like if you were the crypto, just kick back, relax, and watch the map, and just go to town. But enough of that. 
Until next time, folks, I am Kaiju K. I am Juggernaut Jared. And we will see you all in the future, everyone. Peace out, everybody. And cheers. Peace. Peace. Quick, get us out of here, Juggernaut.